Am I the asshole? For telling my brother I will help him and his children but not his wife? My brother and I were adopted into the same family. He's white and I'm a dark-skinned black woman. Our parents were an interracial couple and our family had some unique challenges over the years but our parents did their very best by us and tried their hardest to get us as much information as possible with our birth families. It was a little easier with mine because I was orphaned and I had two older living birth relatives who were just incapable of caring for me and needed care themselves. My brother had a very different story and he had no information at all. Six years of no contact happened and then he reached out and apologized for letting anything come between us. We have been back on speaking terms for over a year now. It took a while but we are doing so much better. I always loved my brother but was hurt by the stuff that went down between us and me and his wife. A few days ago my brother's family ended up in a shelter. He lost the job he had for many years and took a huge pay cut in the new one at the same time that his former landlord decided to illegally kick them out by changing the locks. My brother did contact a lawyer but nothing is as fast as they show in TV and the movies and they have no place to go. I live in the same city which would allow him to keep what job he has now at least and so he asked if they could stay. I said I would help him and the kids and they could stay. But his wife is not welcome in my home. He told me he would take that which did surprise me some. His wife is pissed. She came after me about separating her children from her and how unhealthy it will be for them to see her in a shithole while they're safe and comfortable with me. She called me all kinds of names like petty and bitchy and an asshole. But it was the comment about the kids that got me questioning. Am I the asshole? Not the asshole, at all. That woman is hideous and I hope this is the first step in your brother divorcing her and taking full custody of the children. If you haven't already, it's time to explain to your brother what she said and why you refuse to let her into your life. Provide a safe and loving home for your brother and his kids. Be a model for a loving and secure family relationship. It may be the first time they see a woman give them consistent loving attention, because I doubt their mom is doing it. Not the asshole. You don't feel safe having a racist woman in your home, therefore she is not allowed in. Not the asshole. Her racist task can stay in a shelter. Tell your brother what she said to you also. Not the asshole. She can t expect you to help her after she treated you like garbage and outed herself as a racist. She brought this 100 upon herself and she also sounds like a bad influence for the children. GSTA, not you. Not the asshole. I wouldn't let her racist ass in my house either. This actually might be your brother's way out of the shit show. Not the asshole. Sounds like she's getting exactly what she deserves. Not the asshole she literally called you a slur. She took your brother from you. She has done nothing but prove she wants nothing to do with you. Therefore, there's no place in your home for her. She can find a place to stay with the skin tone she clearly prefers. If she tries to pressure your brother into pressuring you to let her stay, you should tell him everything. Give the kids a good example of class and dignity. Racism is learned not ingrained, so hopefully, she hasn't taught them anything nasty. Stand firm up. No, not the asshole and don't let that racist, abusive bee scream you into compliance. She brought it on herself by being an awful person otherwise she would get a help as well. You aren't separate in her and her kids. Your brother accepted it and even now she can't stop being awful. Did she do or say something that would give you the impression that she changed? She harassed you before the wedding to not have you in her photos, she got messy with the DNA to justify alienating his adopted family, and now she's back to harassing you to force you to let her stay in your house. What makes you think that if when she gets in your house that she won't become messy yet again? The children need a safe space more than they need a mother right about now. Natar. He left his wife at a shelter because he knows she's the root cause of his estrangement with you and the family. His marriage is in trouble and it seems he may not care that it is. Definitely not the asshole. She showed you exactly who she is. 
not the asshole, a shithole is better than his wife deserves and you would do well to tell him what went down between you two so that he understands what kind of person she really is. Not the asshole. She has displayed her racism and general shitty behavior. Don't let her near your home and remind her of why when hanging up the phone next time she calls. Not the asshole. Some people believe they're entitled to act however they please and then they're surprised when they get what's deserved. Wanting to help your brother is a reflection of your genuine care and you have every right to set your own terms. The children will be fine. Not the asshole. I would sit down and talk to your brother about what happened. However, I have a funny feeling that he knows she wronged you in a way. That's probably why he apologized for letting things come between you two. The fact that he accepted the no wife at your house with no opposition situation is very telling. I think it's time to have a heart to heart with him about this. Not the asshole his children will learn a valuable lesson be nice to people because you might need their help in future. You are absolutely not obliged to house your brother's wife who has treated you badly in the past. If he comes with his kids that's great. Don't worry about her she's none of your concern. I have found myself in a very similar situation recently. I commend you on your ability to put your past behind you. I am having a harder time when it. My situation is different in that I wasn't contacted until they were desperate. You guys had re-established a relationship beforehand. Good luck. No judgment. I'm too close. Not the asshole. Please don't let her abusive name callings waver your decision. Not the asshole. She doesn't get to try and push you out of your brother's life and then expect help. If she really cared about her kids, she would take the deal. Not the asshole. Did you tell your brother about the racist crap? Maybe he's trying to get away from her. Stay strong. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. And the fact your brother agreed speaks volumes. There is more going on and you'll possibly find out if your brother opens up to you. Not the asshole. Honestly, you're a saint to help your brother after he chose to be with someone like that. Not the asshole and he agreed too. There is more going on him guessing. No way in heck would I let a woman in my home that called me a slur and still was a witch to me. Not the asshole toxic a racist people need not be in your life and especially not in your house. I applaud you for taking in your brother and his kids. Not even close to being T.A. You have offered a safe place for the children which as a mother she should be thankful for. Not the asshole. I think you've been taking it easy on her. It's hard to believe you can be silent about things and he doesn't see what an awful person she is, anyway. If I were him, I would want to know everything. Always glad to cut racists out. They are usually horrible people in other ways so being racist just makes it easier to cut ties. Not the asshole remind her that she didn't want to have anything to do with a you can guess the slur, and that you were complying with her wishes. That maybe she's the one who made your brother's life harder after all these years. The fact that your brother accepted this offer is what tipped this from an ESH to not the asshole for me. I get the feeling this marriage is on its last legs, and for good reason. It took your brother a while to figure out who he married, but better late than never. A word of advice document everything. This is going to be a very ugly divorce and you are definitely getting drawn into it, unfortunately. Well can his birth family not help her out? Lol Natar. Not the asshole. Let's be clear here, she is the one depriving her children of a safe place to stay. They have their father there. She just isn't willing to do what she needs to to take care of her kids. This is not on you. Not the asshole and it sounds like the kids will be better off away from her. Did your father also post about this? Read something from the adopted parent's perspective that sounds exactly the same. What makes her think her harassing and insulting you is going to get her in your house any faster? Does she not understand that she is in a situation where she is negotiating from a position of weakness? Not the asshole and still needs to chill with the racism. 
I wouldn't want that in my house and the fact she's behaving this way only proves she would not respect you at all if you decided to take her in. Frankly let the trash take itself out and then take care of your niece and nephews. Not the asshole you have no obligation to let a racist bully into your home. Not the asshole do not budge. Also tell him every single thing she said before they move in. It's essential. Also she doesn't set a foot in your home he takes the kids elsewhere to visit their mother. Also you tell him any racism is not tolerated and they will be out if his wife sends you any more abuse. Not the asshole she is a horrible racist. Please tell your brother what she said to you before. Not the asshole let her sit her racist ass down in a shelter, she shouldn't want to be in the home of slur she called you anyway. Sucks to be her. Her kids will be fine. Not the asshole. Play stupid games, win stupid prizes. Your racist sister-in-law can go pound salt. Maybe that can be her new job as it sounds like she doesn't have one to help out anyway. Plus it sounds like your brother is over her shit too. Tell her she can go live with his so-called real relatives since she likes them so much better. F her. Not the asshole but you definitely should tell your brother about the racist behavior and shitty comments she gave you back then and now. Not the asshole, and this sounds like a separate post where a father talks about his adopted son becoming estranged after marrying a woman who did the it's the same case, I hope the son is starting to see her for who she really is. Not the asshole don't let her in your home. Not the asshole. She should be happy her kids are warm and safe with you. What mother would rather her kids be homeless? Also your brother is not cool. He chose to marry a racist. That's far worse than say someone having racist parents where you don't have a choice in who your parents are. And he stayed with her. He's okay with her racism towards you and that's not okay. You're not the asshole. She is reaping what she has sown and getting exactly what she deserves. Not the asshole. She fucked around, and now she's finding out. Not the asshole, tell him what she did and said. I bet you would have wanted your brother to tell you what your spouse said if the roles were reversed. Keeping him in the dark is unfair to him. And of course you are well within your right to refuse to house racists. We should all refuse to house racists. Not the asshole and karma something is a cruel mistress tell her you don't want to live under the roof of over what she called you. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. You're allowed to have boundaries. Not allowing racist people into your home is a very reasonable boundary. Stick to it. Let your brother know that if he or his children demonstrate any of the racism that she has shown you, that they will be kicked out and sent back to their mother. Racism is disgusting. She is an asshole. Not the asshole. If you let her into your home, she'll continue to be nasty and try to treat you as her servant. I think you need to make a full disclosure about your experience with Syl to your brother. Make it clear that you will call the police to remove Syl if she shows up at the house. He's welcome to spend time with his wife but it can't be under your roof. Also ask brother what is his plan for the next 3-6 months. Not the asshole I wouldn't trust that woman enough to leave her alone in my safe space with everything I own either. Not the asshole. I am so proud of you for standing up for yourself. Not the asshole. Such a shame you didn't tell your brother she was a racist control freak before he married her. Be honest and open with your brother and don't let her split you apart again. Fuck that racist. She's reaping what she sowed. Not the asshole. Make sure your brother knows the whole story. Not the asshole. Funny how she is now using other terms now that she wants to live off of your own money. FFS just tell your brother what that witch said er to if you don't say anything but Natar for keeping that racist away from your family. Not the asshole, but be careful. She will work on the kids to resent you. Please tell them your reasons so she won't have leverage. Not the asshole. You were not welcome in her home why should she be welcome in yours? Natar get him alone and show him the post. Not the asshole. 
you didn't separate her from her children you set a reasonable boundary that you won't allow her and her racist abuse in your home. Your brother decided that is best for his children. The only place you've been wrote in any of this was not letting your brother know what she said to you before the wedding, because he's been operating without the whole picture all along. Not the asshole at all she can go fuck herself.